so here you are. <laughs> Viola, this is an order. Get out immediately. I refuse your order. If you try to interfere, I'll kill you. Why do you want him so badly? He's only a kid. Only a kid, is he? <laughs> it's not just that frame that makes him so good. I know that. Just get out of there. The mission will be accomplished even without you. So you don't have to die in vain. You should know. Nate is immortal. <laughs> Almost there. Soon, everything will be over. I will search for the time bombs being set in the central hub. I will let you know every time I find one, so give priority to detonating it correctly, rather than to destroying the enemy. Detonating bombs correctly? How do I do that? It is the same as grab and throw. Keep holding the bomb until it explodes. We will direct the blast into a vector trap. I got it. Be sure not to throw it. I'll try. So we gotta scan and we gotta find bombs. Wow. Also, um, thing there was Ada said to prioritize detonating bombs. Man, what the crap? When did you guys get friggin' powerful? We have shot down the enemy. We have obtained the metaclone ore. This is already irritating. We have shot down like, the enemy. Like, seriously, crap. Friggin'. But she said to prioritize bombs over dudes. Don't. Prioritize dudes over bombs. Because if there are dudes, the dudes will just straight up murder you and you won't be able to detonate the bomb. Or a shot from the dude will hit the bomb and blow up both of you. So, um, yeah. Prioritize dudes, then bomb. You just gotta play quick, play fast. Enemy backup forces are in battle position. Just let me kill this off before they hit me. Let me do this before they hit me with anything. Yes! Wow, that was like spot on last second. Also, this is where the dash forward into dude is your best option. The enemy AIs aren't super great at dealing with it. Oh, this guy's just level two. We have shot down the enemy. Okay, bomb. Bomb getting. Just don't shoot me or nothing. There we go. Metatron! Oh, that's pretty handy. Nothing? Not much in the way of reinforcements there. Oh, oh, you're a reinforcement. Crap. Friggin' level 7? This is especially against those guys. Especially against, like, the big punchin' dudes. Since close range isn't really an option, you don't have time to, like, fudge around. Your dash attack is actually really useful. <laughs> now, dealing with Zombie Neath actually isn't ridiculously difficult as long as you stay on your toes and are aware of what she's going to do, and you can a allow yourself to dodge at a moment's notice. However, the suggested strategy is, by many people, is actually to get in close range with her. And I've been having jack-all luck with that. She's actually really adept at dodging out of the way of your attack and hitting you when you have very little room to dodge out of the way. 
I'm gonna try to take her out close range, despite that I really do not recommend doing it. Just be aware and take things slow at range. But we'll see how things go. I'm gonna wait for her to do her... Ow! Dang it. That's not the attack that I'm waiting for you to use! That was actually the attack I was waiting for her to use. Nope, 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 getting the crap away from her there. Okay, that still hurts, good to know. The blue laser is probably one of the hardest ones to dodge out of the way of. Because it homes in. Nope, 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 ah, jeez. And that's what happens if you stay close range with her too, for too long. Nope. Nope, 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 nope. Using the um, little shot here to keep her guarding until I get close enough. And that'll do it. Do you want me to shift the monitor to the outer camera? Yes. Ada, could we go and save the frame? Jehuti is not designed to resist entry into Jupiter's magnetic storm. The orbital frame is already being pulled ever faster by gravity. While it is not impossible to save the orbital frame, it is very risky. Any ideas? Stop it. What? Still you insult me. Don't even consider it. If you save me, I will fight you again. And I will kill you. I'll kill the people that are precious to you first, and then you. And you won't be the last. I'll continue to kill even after that. But you <laughs> I was beaten by such a naive brat. Viola. I have lost everything. I survived many battles. I lost my parents and my lover. I don't have the functions of a woman now. Even then, I have continued to live. Right. To survive was the only purpose to life. To survive is my life. In battle, there's a slight gap between life and death. Those who were killing were themselves dead a moment later. I killed innocent children and even my comrades to save myself. Soaking in their blood and eating their flesh, I managed to live this long. It is not a matter of my luck. It was only my vibrant power that kept me alive. I survived through my own strength. You ruined it for me. Who the hell are you? What am I inferior to you in? Have you ever, have you ever experienced any hardship in your life? You, your very existence itself, 
denies mine. Time to end it. Finally, I am finished. My ill-fated days forever over. Boy, will you answer one stupid question? Yes. What is it? Was I strong? It's hard to believe that I'm still alive. Is that so? <laughs> The target is disintegrating. Viola? Beautiful. You knew how beautiful the stars really are. Viola! Brada. At last, I can be with you. The target has ceased functioning. Confirmed. What is it? What's going on? Ada? I detect an enemy presence behind us. Deputy is resonant with that thing. Ada? Where did it come from? Radar didn't catch it. In our present condition, you cannot defeat Anubis. Recommend you fly away. Anubis, you said? You know it? Ada! That frame is another Jehuti. You two are not destined to meet yet. What do you mean? I knew others could be killed, but I never thought it could happen to Viola. She was a capable officer. You! You ordered all this! No, not me. <laughs> well, perhaps. In any case, you will die. A farewell gift to Viola. <laughs> has dropped to minus 99.83. I was so close! Leo, can you hear me? Leo? Elena? I'll blast a hole in the side walls of the central hub in 15 seconds. Follow the beacon signal. I'll give you cover with my cannons. Be careful. If you deviate even slightly from the beacon, you'll get burned. I'll try. See you soon. Good luck. to veer away from the crosshairs marking the beacon. Roger! Is that the one?
Good job, boy. Where's Selvis? Don't worry. She's just fine. Good. Let me go and pick you up. It will require three minutes to stow away in the hangar and to pressurize. Please wait. You know, thank you for everything. Because you are with me, I survived. I feel the same. Thank you for helping me out. Is that the right usage of words to show human gratitude? <laughs> sort of, yes. Well, what are you going to do now? What? After you reach Mars. You have an important mission, don't you? If it's okay with you. I mean, after you finish your mission. Jehuti's duty on Mars is to penetrate the military fortress Alman and to destroy the fortress from the inside by self-destructing Jehuti. Jehuti will self-destruct? By deliberately overactivating the generator, Jehuti will generate a maximum of 22.3 gigatons. That is equal to the power of 15 positron bombs. Wait a minute! You mean you'll deliberately explode this frame? What about you? All my functions aboard Jehuti will cease. So it's a suicide mission? I thought it was you who told me not to waste my life! Pressurization is complete. Opening the hatch. Thank you. Ada! This is what I live for. This is the purpose of living. For those who have no life. No! Shit, shit, shit,
始まる。